Starting uh, with claims coming out of the State Capture Commission, former Independent Police Investigative Directorate Head uh, Robert McBride has accused former Police Minister Nati Antleko of interfering in probes and undermining due process just to fire him. McBride continued with his testimony at the State Capture Commission of Inquiry, focusing on investigations by law firm Worksmans. The firm was appointed to investigate IPID's handling of the Zimbabwean renditions case, where senior Hawks officials were accused of orchestrating the arrest and unlawful deportation of a Zimbabwean suspect. Good morning, Mr. Pretorius. Good morning, everybody. Morning, Chair. More revelations of interference on the state security agencies. Former IP boss says a legal report commissioned by former police minister Natin Tleko falsely accused him of defeating the ends of justice. McBride told the commission that investigators were targeted for tackling corruption. He also told the commission that Ntleko used the workman's report to justify his action against him and several investigators. McBride was suspended in 2015 for allegedly altering a report by IPED on former Hawks boss Eno Dramat and Hawks Houting head Shadrach Sibir. They were accused of illegally deporting a group of Zimbabweans wanted for murder. For the minister then to misuse that to, to attempt to contact directly um, officials in the department um, is basically an abuse of the respect that uh, civil servants show to seniority. And it could not have been for a good reason. It couldn't have been for some reasonable purpose. Why wasn't he just why wasn't he just happy to allow processes to continue? McBride also claims his arrest in 2016 was unlawful. In my view, insufficient time to go through four liver arch files. We were told we must appear on the Monday that we will be charged. And we went to court and we were told to to go to the, um, the client customer center, previously known as the charge office, where we were charged and put in cells. We'll then adjourn until Monday. We adjourn. All right. He will continue his testimony on Monday. Ntlan Zakatani, SABC News, Johannesburg.